nice little video of our uh, 62 foot uh, trailer, Atco style trailer. I'm just taking a short walk around. All the doors are 36 inch. It's got uh, air conditioning unit, furnaces on the back side of that wall. Um, it's prepped up and connected to propane right now. So the furnace is propane. Uh, down here, right there, we've got the, uh, the drain connection for the washroom. And that runs into a tank underground here with a pump out. So it's currently all connected. You can come take a look. I'm gonna go through this here door. Originally as a originally used as an on-site office trailer. Back entry leads into this room. A little office desk space was used. We've been using it just for tool storage and stuff right now. Um, full electrical panel, full furnace room, independent furnace room. Runs on propane, and that first office, again, we're just using it as a crib. Got some shelving in there, nice bright windows in every office. Great hallway, uh, laminate floor, not laminate, sorry, uh, hard vinyl floor. It's not a plank, it's a full sheet, so it's end to end the entire building. The, again, second office, little desk. 36 inch doors, no water damage, no leaks in the ceiling, no issues with exterior walls, no dents, no dings. There's a little cabinet set right here. And office number three, got a nice big desk in there. Again, big window, we've got emergency lighting in the whole place. Good electrical outlets in every room. If you uh, power it up, here's the bathroom, sink, shower, and toilet. Nice big bathroom in really excellent, excellent condition. Okay, there's a little coat rack by the side door. So we came in through the end side door. Here's the mechanical room with your boiler, your 500 gallon tank, and the uh, janitorial sink, so mop bucket sink in there. And then we've got, and of course the plumbing right now is connected, so water lines can all run, but they've all been blown out. So this is now, it's currently winterized. This is office number four, or the end room. Again, big windows, lots of desk space, lots of places for whiteboards, lots of uh, meeting space. We thought about, because it's on the back side, we thought about turning this into the kitchenette. Never did get around to that, so. All right, so we're gonna go out the side door. Going out the side door. See, those are the hall windows, door, the end. This unit is built on a giant steel skid. I'll show you that. A giant steel skid, and it's got steel rail all the way underneath, all the way along. It's designed to be picked up by a roller truck, which saves in terms of transport. I don't know if I could show you underneath there, but. It's got a solid base underneath on top of the steel rail, and then it's got a solid one piece roof all the way across with only the two penetrations for the exhaust of the furnace and the exhaust in the bathroom. So this is a beautiful, beautiful unit. Could be used as a bunkhouse, could be used as, as a site office, could be used as a large cabin. Heck, you could even turn it into a home if you wanted.